right. We had a email about <clears throat> things of um, the concern. And the email was about is about marriage. Well, for whoever emailed that, <laughs> it obviously hasn't been through one. Well, the whole thing for me with my marriage was, I mean, for one, you, you can't really tell if your wife's happy. That's for one. And she looks happy, but I think deep down they're really not. Because they're so worried about bills, and they're so worried about things you're not worried about. I mean, you'll go to, like, work. And if you have a hard job and you work all day, you'll come home and then uh, you'll try to relax to recuperate for the next day, you know, because you know it's a long week and you're like, God, please hurry up Friday. Shit. Come on, Friday. <laughs> That's all you can say at work. <laughs> That's where you get your free time. Or whatever you do. Um, but you'd get home, and you'd be like, um, and you'd see your wife, and, uh, and you, you know, you try to talk to them, but, you know, they don't really feel like talking all the time. So, um. Uh, you just kind of tend to do what you need to do. I mean, it's like a job. When you get home, it's like a whole other job, guys. It's like something you're going to have to work out. It, this thing about happily married is crap. Okay? It's a job, guys. When you get home, that's another job. You're going to have to look at it as another job. That's what it is. It's too hard to contrast what you got to do it's it's painful I mean and they're not gonna tell you how to fix it believe me they're not gonna tell you they won't tell you and if you try to do better it's not better enough for them it never is they always want more so it's like a job when you get home from your regular job guess what buddy when you drive home in your car you got another job to do. It's another job. And the only time you can think of resting could be on your days off or time that um, time that you're going to have to have to find yourself some place to go on your days off or something. Because I'm not saying don't spend it with your wife. But I'm saying when you get home, that's another job, buddy. You just can't sit around the house. You're going to have to work. It's That's the way it is. That's the way it, it's, it has to be. That's the way that'll make them happy, I guess. I don't know. But I really thought in my marriage that it would be a whole lot easier... If I try to, you know, show her what I did, but it didn't do any good. It, all it did was confuse her, and I'm telling you, it's just like another job. When you get home, you are the man in the house. You, you have to do your time. You have to go and cook supper. You have to go and make sure the kids have everything they need. You're going to have to go and get off that TV. You don't even have TV in your life, and if you do, Watch it late at night. Watch it whenever nobody's watching you. Don't watch it in front of her. Because she's dependent on you. And that's the way it feels. I mean, you think it's like your family when you were growing up, but it's not. It's, there's something that she wants from you, but she will never tell you. She just expects you to know. And, you know... It's come to all this time to understand I think that's exactly what she wanted. But, you know, I could never really get it out of her. 
But for all in that matter, um, marriage is tough. If you really want to get married, you better really think about it. You better think about your life. You better start thinking about um, priorities that are important to her. You're going to have to really think. Marriage is just not an easy step. It's, it is so hard. It's, it's, it's too much to explain, really, in one tape. In one, in a, <laughs> it's too much. It's too hard sometimes. And the things that you just went through, they're unbelievable sometimes. But anyways, I gotta go. Cooking biscuits. I wanted to burn.